Lindmar LMTV, Lindmar Television. Lindmar, your news starts now. Hey Lindmar, it's Thursday, November 3rd, 2022. It's cliche day. Here's a look at what's happening across the campus. It's opening night for the freshman play, She Kills Monsters. LMTV's Jacob is here to tell us more. She Kills Monsters is a drama comedy play that tells the story of Agnes Evans, an average woman who loses her parents and little sister Tilly in an unfortunate car accident. While being very distant from her sister while she was alive, Agnes embarked on an adventure to get to know her sister better by playing a Dungeons and Dragons module Tilly had written and discover things she never would have imagined. The plot takes place in reality and the imaginary world. There are two shows tonight and tomorrow night at 7 in the Little Theater. Tickets are $5 each or use your activity pass to get in for free. Jacqueline and Leo, back to you. Thanks, Jacob. Auditions wrap up today after school in the choir room for the National Honor Society's lip sync battle with proceeds going to the Wildcat Closet. Contact Mrs. Patterson for more information. Anyone taking an AP class that starts first semester, tomorrow is the last day to pay for your exams. You can pay through Power School or to Mrs. Dayton in the cashier's office. See Mr. McCauley for your team entry form for the annual Soda Coed Volleyball Tournament. It's next Thursday, November 10th at 7 p.m. in the main gym. And those are the LMTV headlines at this hour. I'm no in my sports. Varsity Girls Dyrene is hosting the state qualifying meet tonight at 5 in the Aquatic Center. There's a baseball meeting for all 9th through 12th graders today from 4 to 4.20 in the lecture hall. Come on down to the garage sale for our athletic department. It's Saturday from 8 a.m. to 12 noon in the main gym. The money raised will help buy new uniforms. Most items will sell for $2, 5 10 or $20. Guys thinking about going out for track and field in the spring should come to a meeting next Thursday morning at 8.30 in the lecture hall. That's sports. Back to you. Thanks, Noah. In news from the counselors, Mrs. Bass will be hosting an RTI session about Lindmar scholarships Tuesdays from 3.30 to 4 in the College Career Center. Workplace learning internship applications are for winter and spring are due, for, due tomorrow at noon. Become a Drake Bulldog. A rep from Drake University will be here at 2.30. And now here's Corey with the Arts and Clubs. On the arts and club scene, a fellowship of Christian athletes is celebrating the end of fall sports and the start of winter sports with a pancake breakfast tomorrow morning in the food court. They'll be serving from 7.30 to 8.55. All students and faculty are welcome. There will be pancakes with all fixings in juice or milk. Again, that's FCA pancake breakfast tomorrow morning before school in the food court. FBLA's next member meeting is tomorrow morning at 8.10 in the food court. Donuts and juice will be provided. Don't miss it, they'll be taking pictures for the yearbook. Contest speech short film producers, listen up. See Mr. Fry at 8.30 tomorrow morning in room J201. Be prepared to share a rough idea of your script and a list of people who are on your team. That's Arts and Clubs. Guys, back to you. Thanks, Corey. For lunch downstairs, it's chicken nuggets. The other lines offer pizza, salads, or sandwiches. And in the food court, it's also chicken nuggets. For breakfast tomorrow, it's a breakfast sandwich. Your LMTV forecast calls for mostly sunny skies today and a high of 73. Tomorrow calls for showers and a high of 65. And Saturday will continue to be cloudy with rain and a high of 57. And that wraps up today's edition of LMTV News. LMTV is always available online. Just go to the Linmar website or check us out on YouTube. Join us again tomorrow. And have a lovely day, Linmar.